go, the train is here, week four, let's go. How to network as a creative. Boom, UK Black Business Show, man, let's go. Let's go now. So obviously this time round I'm bringing you with me. I went to this like three years ago. Obviously I was dressed differently, more smart and stuff, but for what we're trying to go for, I think the key thing is obviously checking the fit out and stuff. Yeah, I know it's tight, it's tight, it's tight. You get me? I say that, but then nah, I didn't like them boots. Oh that jacket could have been clean. Allow me please. But the key thing I think with networking is showing up as you want to be received really and truly you know, obviously we're doing our content we're doing our artistry so we got to make that obvious but this is my third rodeo the first thing i went to was like five years ago some tedx talk which was good it was calm until i saw my ex and her man there you feel me man but that's a story time for another time still <laughs> you know what i'm trying to say obviously we're in now we got all the got all the bits like I said, man. Listen, you gotta be daring in life. You know what I'm trying to say? You gotta, if you wanna stand out, you gotta be daring and do it, basically. Yeah, let's see what it brings for us today. You feel me? All right, where's the, where's the corner? Yeah. 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 Gonna see if you get one of those brochures basically that gives us like a booklet for it. Because we're there, we don't even know who's like talking next and everything. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, that's okay. oh no, it's fine. Where can I get one of those? Yeah, can you grab one of these? Yeah? All right, let's just see what this whole program is. Yes, brother, you're right, huh? yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, let me catch you. So, what's your name? My name is Ro, R O E. R O E, and what are you involved in? Um, YouTube, uh -huh. TikTok, all of that basically. Yeah, okay. So maybe you're just obviously covering the other internet. Yeah. What's your name? So my name's Julian. Julian. Yeah, yeah so I've come down from West London. From and West we... London too, bro. Yeah, from Acton, Acton Greenford. Okay, so my kids used to go to Twyford. Is it? I yeah, went to Dormers Wells, bro. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. Twyford. Twyford. Like, Dormers Wells more to the south. south yeah, yeah, yeah. So I live in Hayes. Ah, yeah. man, man. What do you do? So, so I work in um, cyber security okay, I mean, and, and cloud computing and AI and data yeah. management. So I do like the business management side. Yes. Yeah. All right. Where can so, we find you, man? What's your, your handle? You, my you, handle? My handle? Okay. I'm not talking today. You're a guest. I'm a guest, but right, I do talk. All right. right. So my handle is you can catch me on Julian Ace Answer. You can also check out my YouTube channel, which is called Making Moves Ghana. So I cover like all the entrepreneurial startups and Ghanaians who are doing ch change makers in the like global diaspora. So check it out, making moves Ghana. Amazing, we're connected right. anyway. I'm yeah, cool. yeah, yeah. You're not leaving, you're not going home. No, 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 I'm just getting my pass. Yeah, yeah all right, all right. Yeah. yeah. I told you, you got, you just, you just get too much attention. Imagine he was given the handle and the YouTube and that. He didn't even look at me. He looked at you, telling you that. What kind of thing was that, man? It's crazy. Let's see what we got. Cool, so this is what this is. Oh. For the time, networking break. That's now. So this is what that is, five, five to ten minutes. And then... What's up with you, though, bro? Why is your head all up in the brochure and everything? Cool, if you need me to tell you what it is, I'll, I'll tell you what it is. What the... Oh, like you want to swallow the brochure and that. Oh, Kevin Nelson's a legend though. And obviously, man's obviously what music man and that. We gotta stay here. We gotta stay here. Right? We all know about Trevor Nelson, but we just want to get down to the questions, the fantastic um, questions that we have to ask him. Um, so I just want to talk about relevance. Yeah. What's the key to staying relevant, and how do you keep evolving with music? 
peak of the, like if you're an artist, you get five good years, you've had a great career, maybe 10. If you're in the media, if you're the hottest new thing, the, old, the whole idea of you being the hottest new thing is you're new and then you're old. I treated every single radio show like it was my last. I still do. Every single radio show I do, I do it to the best of my ability, I curate it myself, it's my own playlist. So I took my own control, do you know what I mean? The rest of it was out of my hands. And um, I just kept going and going and going. And when opportunities came my way, like big money gigs abroad, I said, no, I've got a radio show to do, which didn't pay me anywhere near the same money. But I made sure that that was my thing, radio. I love radio, it's my favorite thing to do. And that's maybe the only reason why I'm still in it, because I just devoted my life to it. Amazing, amazing. Please give a round of applause for you. Boy, mad, mad, mad. That made it worth it still. So obviously today is just like, I'm here on my own business stuff, because the stuff that I'm doing is completely different from setting up something here in the UK. But again, yeah, get to that in some of the other episodes. But the women's one seems like they got some overall well-rounded one where let's just obviously check out the vibe and that kind of feeds better into the networking for obviously what man around's doing. Film. So go on, go on. from the girl sleeping on the mattress in Summer Nathan, that I do often say to God, if you capped me right here, I'm good. <laughs> like if you said, you know what, Camis, that's your love, you would not hear any complaints from me. Because you, I, I, I say this all the time, many men can acquire a few can maintain. <laughs> Acquiring things is all well and good. The big yard, the car, the body, <laughs> yeah, the Earlier this year, I found out my then management were trolling me. Someone said, huh? <laughs> you heard me. My, my agent at the time, my lead agent, was found to be one of my online trolls. That's him. I you are a But, yes, let the moments run <laughs> But when I say God was getting in my face, and, 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 and God can get at me, you know, and he was getting very tussly. And he was basically saying, I really want to bless you, but there's some heathens at this table. And I refuse to feed them. Come on. So. You went to church today, right? This is where I've been my whole career. One of these women were even on my will. One of these women were on my will to stand in for my children. So that's another thing. Sometimes we sit on our intuition too long, and you have to remember that your intuition is a gift from God. And you also have to understand that you could be doing all that is required of you if you're sitting with the wrong people. The, the blessings going to keep you in return to send up. Because I'm not. Yes! I was going to send up for a bit. Don't give up. No! I'm not going but this talk has honestly made me that much prouder. Before you all get out, I wanted to say a massive. I think it's a Tuesday. I think everybody's going to be running back home. Odd man running home, you know. Well, odd gal, should I say? I was a bit, it's a real still. I wasn't really expecting it. I thought it was like gonna be similar to the other one, but this one was like, I don't know, a mixture of like a woman's like therapy conference thing, mixing with church, mixing with gems, like a whole concoction of the two. But rule number one for networking as a creative go to a creative event. I have to 
say that the Trevor Nelson one for me is probably the best one, obviously, because the man's a radio presenter, in it? Like, it just makes sense. So that's what kind of landed it for me, for me to say, to go and network as a creative, is to go to somewhere creative, in it? It just makes sense. Get me, man. Time to go home, man. Time to get out of here. All right, cool. So let's, let's run through the event. Black Business Show, Black Business Week, rather. Aim of the game is obviously how to network, you know. However, there's two implications for that. Number one, you come here early, so you network before all the events start, basically. That is about. Number two, which should probably be number one, you go where you're supposed to go. If you're networking as a creative, you need to go to a creative space because everybody is on you. Here, there's business, everybody wants to know how to make money, basically, as opposed to the cultural currency and stuff. In terms of free, that's really about how other people are interacting with, with us, isn't it? rather than think, rather than anything with me. Coming forth, wanting to show products, wanting us to take it, wanting us to do all this next stuff. We're actually trying to build a relation, not any contact in terms of... Yes, Robert. Thank you, man. And next week, obviously we're linking up with Curtis. I'm unsure what we're doing. You thought I'm trying to say, I know there's a few different plans or a few different things that we maybe do. Obviously, I went to studio the other week and more time I'm thinking about doing like a open mic and that. There's something outside, but I don't know. So, obviously, if anything, it'll be me and him rolling. And you'll see us obviously just tearing it up, basically, being back on the scene, doing what we need to do for the different spaces, innit, man? But obviously, I'm going to catch the um, flipping Elizabeth flying back to end. We've got the DLR there, innit, for wherever you're going, innit? So, boom! Next week, man, I'll see you there. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's, that's another thing. Okay. Actually. Not, not